Hey guys, please make sure to like and subscribe. I would love to hit 800 subs by the end of today. That would very much be appreciated. Also, make sure to join the Discord down in the description. I do giveaways. I give free PSs. And I'm always active with the chat. I do game nights. And I love being with you guys. So, it would very much be very bueno if you guys could do all that. Okay, guys. Now starting. I did get a couple of leaks. Um, I will be going over my thoughts, my opinions, and things I would like to see. Things that I think would be good for the game. And just, you know, stating facts. Because that's the only thing I do. Okay, so this is the first thing we have, and personally, one of my favorite leaks that I've seen so far. So it's basically a model for Doki using her OB slashes, or things, whatever they are called, or whatever you want to call them. So they basically come out of her, right? Pause. They spread out, and then they just slash down. Now, that covers a lot of space, and it will probably be dungeon meta, and maybe even PvP meta, because I'm guessing there will be stuns and maybe counters. So I see it having a lot of potential. And I think it's something very cool. And so far, the quality of it actually looks fire. The animations are pretty smooth, and I enjoy watching this. So one thing is, I absolutely love Doki. I don't think I really need to explain why. But I just love her BDA. I love her design. I, lo I love, love her design. Um, you know, I think she's a pretty cool demon, right? She, she is pretty weak. And she does hold back Yutaro, which is another one of my favorite demons. But... She's still overall a good character, and I would really love to see how they implement her character design, her character values, and things into the game. Next up is just a picture of the Obies with your Roblox modeled character. And as you can see, they, they come from your back and they kind of wrap around and over your body and come out in the front. Um, something that I do think is cool that, is that they also released the picture showing the more in-depth version of the Obies, and this is what it looks like. And... That should be all for Doki. Secondly, another thing I would very much love and appreciate if it would come up on this update is Gutero. Something having to do with Gutero, maybe Gutero Sickles. Those are his preferred weapons, and they are mad sick. His BDA is just super cool. It's interesting, you know. It's kind of a poison flesh, you know, just basically. It's it's more of a physical BDA. It's not like control over Obis like Doki or control over pots or control over ice. It's just... A physically, you know, empowered BDA. Entertainment District. It's just one of those arcs that are beautiful. You know, there's sadness, there's happiness, there's a lot of fights, it's chaotic, it's funny, it's it's just great, right? It'd be really cool if they added it to the game. They already added sound breathing, which is very cool. It's literally the best breathing, and it came from Entertainment District. I'd like to see what they're going to do with Gear Tour's BDA and... O OB, the OB BDA, which is Doki's BDA, I think they're probably going to add in two BDAs along with two breathings, which is not going to leave either stone breathing or serpent breathing up for the last one, since they already added sound, or hell, maybe they might go three this time, since they already added sound, they're just going to add stone and serpent, or it, it, we're just going to have to wait and see, you know? Okay, guys, last reminder to please make sure to like and subscribe and join the Discord. It is linked in the description. I would so much love to hit 800 subs today. It would be a huge milestone for me as I am averaging 100 subs a day. I still appreciate you guys so much and I'm so grateful for all the recent support I have been getting. So, peace.